welcome back into Studio 10. And you know we love to break the rules and step outside the box, especially when it comes to fashion. That's why Jess Melton from Rebel Mimi Boutique is still here with us today. So first, in Rebel Mimi style, <laughs> explain to us, what does fall fashion look like here? It's a vibe. It is rich colors, browns, um, olive green, wine, um, cognac. It's, yes. That's my favorite, honestly. Okay. So a mixture of all those colors, mustard. You have to have mustard in there. Well, wine and brown are my favorite fall colors, okay? And speaking of, we've got one set right here. Talk to me about what this is, what it looks and feels like, mm -hmm. and how you paired it together. Absolutely. So I have a whole team. I need, I, I'd be remiss if I didn't mention them. You know, mm -hmm. our, our team at Rebel Mimi, it's a collective effort. So sometimes I'll come into the store and there's a whole new setup, and it always looks amazing. So a okay. lot of diversity. Um, this in particular, so this dress, um, mm -hmm. I love all the mix of the rust, the mustard, the cream, the cocoa. Yeah. Um, it's short sleeve. So mm -hmm. sometimes with Michigan, it starts off really chilly, the cardigan. Like this cardigan, morning. Right? right, exactly. So yes. having a nice um, <laughs> slinky soft cardigan um, yeah. over the, sh the short sleeve gives you a little bit of versatility. I like that. And what is it about plaid that is just so fall? First of yeah. all, I've never seen it like this in brown. Normally I see it in red and yeah. black. But I love this. But why do you think it just screams fall? I, it's just the mix of color. Plaid is just so classy to yeah. me. Um, you can't go wrong with a plaid. And I love the tear also. So it gives it kind of a little whimsy. Just okay. a touch. Not too much. So I just love um, the mix of the color. and. Any kind of plaid. I'm a big fan of plaid. Any kind of plaid. You heard that right. Rebel Mimi says any kind of plaid this season. But you've got some other pieces behind you. Talk to me about how you paired the accessories here. Sure. So I really want to mention this necklace here. So mm -hmm. we love to prioritize local women artists. Yeah. And this necklace in particular was made by Dazzling Night Creations in Grand Ledge, right okay. in Grand Ledge. Um, so the silver and the black, I love the way that it looks together. Again, that flutter sleeve, really, really um, flattering, no matter the body type. Uh -huh. um, this actually on the body is much more, it's closer, it doesn't, it's not as much of a V. Okay. Um, and the silver with the black just look great. Right, me. sometimes when it's a little revealing. That's oh, right. And I've had moments too where I'm like, Nicole, do you have any safety pens? That's Let's right. to put this together. Nope, not but with this not one. it's not exactly what it seems. And speaking of supporting other women businesses, you've got a group that you hang with in Grand Ledge. Tell us about them really quick. I do. It's the Bridge Street Besties. That's um, Low Brands It, mm -hmm. uh, who's uh, branding and photography in Grand Ledge. Mm -hmm. And... Um, 1943 company, which is an events planning business, and so we love to do all kinds of collaboration together in our fall photo shoot. That's who was doing the photos and the modeling. I love that. Woman supporting other women. That is exactly, that's also the tagline of Rebel Mimi that's too. That's right. <laughs> but let's talk about these stripes oh, that we have here. This is breaking all the rules, right? Yes. As we were growing up, um, depending on body types, you stayed away from horizontal stripes. Mm -hmm. We don't do that anymore. We don't play by those rules. No, we so don't. So this cream and black um, striped long sleeve dress is so flattering, so soft and comfortable. Um, and it can go from early fall all the way through winter. So I really love that. And what I also love is that this is a big piece that we can kind of mix and match too. Absolutely. With, don't you think? Black blazer by itself, cardigan, mm -hmm. um, really fun pop of color if you want to put a, a pop mm -hmm. of color. There's a um, velvet, uh, magenta velvet blazer that we have that's uh -huh. really fun with that. But and speaking of stepping outside the box too, I like that this is a gold metal, not a silver. I think right. a lot of times when we do black, especially with cream, at least I. I've been told a lot of things growing up when it comes to fashion. You have to use the certain type of metals, but I like how you're going outside the box here with that too. Yep. So um, fall, I, I tend to go more gold in fall for somebody that's just a personal yeah. preference, but a lot of times you do see silver with black like you did here. Gold, gold's amazing with black too, yeah. uh, especially with that cream. Yeah, gold in fall. And really quick, one thing I just want to say, sometimes we get stuck in our head or really even stuck in the dressing room. How do you ri remind women to kind of get out of their comfort mm -hmm. zone when they are putting something on and they're, they're a little too afraid that it might look revealing or it's showing more curves? What do you tell them? Um, it really helps. Uh, our team's amazing when it comes to that. They will tell you the truth if you're looking, going for a certain look. Um, but we're our own worst critic, honestly. The yeah. things that we see about ourselves, others don't. And so it's nice to have somebody that will give you feedback that you trust will tell you when things look good and you're just not feeling all that secure. But the truth is, even if we think it looks great on you, if you're not comfortable with it, with it you're probably not going to wear it. And so we, we don't want you to leave with it. I love that, Jess. And I'm so glad that you are a friend that we can certainly <laughs> yes. trust and help dress us. Thank you so much for joining us. We've got information on your screen because as you saw, these are only a few pieces that you can find at Rebel Mimi. But thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you. And also, pleasure. today it's Screamtober. We took a trip to Awaken.